be ready 5 seconds start the present appeal depicts a factual score where this court is constrained to say that delay in disposal of the application by the debts recovery tribunal and the appeal by debt recovery appellate tribunal have the effect potentiality of creating a corrosion in the economic spine of the country it exposits a factual expose which is not only perplexing but usher in a sense of puzzlement which in the ultimate eventuate compels one to ask how long can the financial institutions would suffer such attitude how far the public interest be put to hazard because of small and sometimes contrived individual interest to what extent the defaulters be given protection in the name of balancing the stringent powers vested on the banks and the statutory safeguards prescribed in favor of loanees even assuming there are legal lapses and abuses how long the statutory tribunals take to put the controversy to rest being oblivious of the fact that the concept of flexibility is inseparately associated with valuation of any asset the present appeal by special leave is directed against the judgment and order dated passed by the high court of delhi in writ petition the facts which are essential to be stated are that the appellant bank sanctioned home loan of rupees 12 lakhs to the respondent number 1 payable in equal monthly installments and in lieu of that the borrower mortgaged the property which was purchased from the developer the respondent number 2 here in since the respondent number 1 failed to pay the installments the loan account was declared as non performing asset in terms of the npa guidelines issued by the reserve bank of india the appellant bank issued a notice under section 132 of the security session and reconstruction of financial assets and enforcement of security interest act 2002 to the respondent number 1 directing him to pay the amount due since the respondent number 1 did not make any payment the tahsildar gurgaon took possession of the mortgage property as per the order of the district magistrate and handed over the same to the appellant bank the appellant bank in order to sell the said property published possession come sale notice in the leading newspapers stating the terms and conditions of the public auction in response to the said notice the respondent number 3 submitted its bid form for purchasing the said property the said action was challenged by filing an application under section 171 read with section 19 of the act before the debt recovery tribunal the application was presented on before the rt2 delhi and the concerned presiding officer declined to pass any order and sought appropriate directions from the debt recovery appellate tribunal for transfer of the said application to some other drt as no order was passed by the drat the matter was again placed before the drt2 and that day the drt was informed that the bank had already taken over possession of the property in question and put the same into auction for sale the borrower preferred a writ petition before the high court on and the high court directed the borrower to deposit certain amount with the bank and further directed status quo as regards the property to be maintained eventually the high court wide order only directed the drt to dispose of the appeal within 2 months 
while finally disposing of the writ petition the high court opined that though no order was passed by the drt as the presiding officer was awaiting orders from the appellate forum decided to sell the property to render the appeal of the borrower to become infructuous and try to non suit him be it noted the drt void its order transferred the case to another debt recovery tribunal as the property was sold in auction the auction purchaser the third respondent herein filed an application for impleadment which was allowed before the drt her stand was that she had deposited the entire amount of rupees 25 lakhs with the bank and if the borrower was still interested to retain his property he had to purchase it from her the drt by its orders adverted to the facts assertions made in the application filed by the borrower reply filed by the bank and appreciating the evidence on record came to hold that there was no infirmity in the statement of accounts of the bank and thereafter taking into consideration the facts and circumstances granted 15 days time to the borrower to pay the entire amount to the bank and the developer messers unitech and rupees 1 lakh as compensation to the auction purchaser thereafter the drt directed as in case the applicant appellant fails to deposit this amount within 15 days the appeal application be treated as dismissed and respondent number 1 is free to confirm the sale in favor of the auction purchaser now